The 19-inch rack mount successor is one of our most popular units ever. Used and loved by thousands of musicians and engineers, it has become an essential part of their setup, and for good reason. Based around a diode bridge design, a fat, warm, character-filled tone is achieved. With an ultra-fast response, you can obtain some of the biggest, thickest sounds you can imagine. With the addition of the parallel processing and sidechain filter sections, you have tons of creative possibilities at hand. Originally thought of for mix bus duties, its appealing attitude and processing power has actually ended up blessing all the different stages of music production, be it during tracking, mixing, or even mastering. So when the time came to bring out a new plugin, it was a no-brainer. After having received tons of customer requests throughout the years, the time has come and the successor plugin is available today. On the far left, you see the large VU meter to constantly be able to monitor the amount of gain reduction taking place. This will conveniently light up when the compressor is active and turn off in bypass mode. The dynamics button will engage the compressor and start the fun. The threshold knob gives you a generous minus 20 to plus 20 dB range to decide how much and when the compression will commence. The ratio switch gives you six different choices between an extremely gentle 1.5 to 1 all the way up to limiting. Six attack times are available starting with an ultra-fast 50 microseconds up to a relatively easy-going 20 milliseconds. Six release settings span from 25 to 400 milliseconds with an extra two automatic settings, fast on peaks and slow on sustained material. Another six position switch allows you to choose different internal sidechain filter options to fine tune exactly what part of the signal, frequency wise, you'd like to treat. This can be very useful as well as providing more creative choices. The gain makeup will give you 10 dBs in 2 dB steps to recover any output loss due to compression. The internal parallel processor is controlled with a blend knob to decide the exact amount of compression applied to the dry signal, as well as a button to activate the blend control or bypass it altogether. Warning! This can get wild here. The newly added nuke button will apply an extra 20 dBs to the signal being processed in order to make the compressor work much harder and provide even more of its gorgeous tone and texture. We've also included an extra control to give you up to 20 more dBs for when you are doing extreme compression and more makeup gain is required. When using the Nuke mode, we highly recommend combining it with the Blend feature so you can perfectly fine-tune the precise amount of aggressive compression being added back in to the dry, original signal. Visit users.heritageaudio.com and get your hands on one today.